Hi guys and welcome. If you want to build your own landing page, definitely this video can be handy for you because in this video I want to show you all the things that you need to build your first landing page using the website building platform that as my uh, as I think one of the best in the world for the moment and that's what I want to show you in this video. I'll provide you with an all information that you need to build your own landing page fast, easy and without an extra efforts. So before I've started, I want to say that our team left the link in the description panel of this video and you can easily get access to this platform straight from this video. So you just need to find the link and click on it and you'll be on the start page. Then you need to press the start free trial and the platform itself will ask you uh, to choose a plan first. Uh, definitely you need to pass this step. And after you get your 14 day trial, that is pretty enough to build everything up and go live with your landing page. I don't want to make this video like one hour long, like one of those videos in uh, YouTube that you can saw. Uh, so I want to make this video as short as possible with a maximum value and, and I'm not wasting your time. So jump in. To the dashboard straight away that how the platform looks from inside and we need to press the create new landing page and you'll see a lot of different templates that are pre-built already for any of your business purposes that you can even imagine now uh, there's a sort list like page type you see that there's a lot of things industry and so on the style color so you can choose any template because any um, any template is suitable, but in this case, in this spot, you need to be as specific as possible. For example, you're working in a business in marketing, so why you should use the financial and legal or wealth and wellness? Yeah, you need to be as specific as possible. And in that case, you'll save some time on editing of your uh, landing page, but all the editing features are pretty the same, and that's what I want to show you in this uh, in this video. So let's start building this one, uh, this template. First, you need to give your page a name. You can change it later. Uh, and it really, it really matters if you have the name of your business. But for, for this case, just to show you, it doesn't matter. I choose this template. The layout is pretty simple. And I will show you what are, uh, what are those buttons. So layout sections, widgets, styles and settings, uh, those buttons you will use to to build up everything. Redo, undo, get feedback is not important. And preview, uh, you need to know that all the pages built with this fantastic tool are mobile responsive, are adoptable for any platform. And uh, you can be sure that everything will be visible. Everything will work properly on any platform or it's going to be the desktop or it's going to be tablet or mobile uh, platform. So everything is pretty cool about that layout. What do we have here? Body and footer. Uh, there's only two sections. Everything pretty built up with the sections on any uh, website building platform. And uh, here's also so you can add a section. There's an impressive list of pre-built sections that you can just drag and drop to any spot where you can see um, drop here if you didn't found the section that you want you can use the blank one to place it here all right let's go to layout back body footer blank faqs we can delete uh, the sections from this spot or we can delete a section from this spot we don't need those actually to show you what's happening you see the footer is under the blank uh, section so we need to grab this footer on this spot and just drop it here you see that there's a page background and I will show you how to manage that but first we're gonna talk about the widgets you see it's a great list of them but actually those eight is all you need to build your own landing page for example I wanna I want the video to be here. I'm just drag and dropping it and button to be here. I'm just drag and dropping it. There's a divider as we have two columns. There's a divider and you can reshape uh, your layout in each section and just 
moving this with a spacer. And that's pretty it. If you want to change the background of entire section of one section, you need to press this three dots button and you can edit section settings, add section buffer below, duplicate, copy or delete. So let's edit section settings. We see there's no background color. You can change height of this uh, section manually or it can be automatically shaped uh, and let it be like that. So yeah, when you're hovering over the uh, over your picture, over your section, you see that there are some elements here. Yeah, divider that I showed you, spacer and the text and the button. Uh, this pencil button, when you press it, you can change all the things with the text. When you press it, you can change all the things with a style uh, about buttons. I'm going to show it to you right now. So what's happening with the buttons? You can make it full width, you can make it small, you can make it bigger or uh, smaller. You can make it rounded and change the shape of the button manually or you can make it circular, line and gradient. You see, I love actually to be the square and line and that looks pretty great, but it's almost invisible here. But in this case, it works properly. So everything that you can make with the text is pretty simple. You can change the text as you want, uh, bold, italic and, and so on and so on. It's pretty simple. I will not show it to you because um, nobody except you can describe your business better and you know what to type into your first page. And the main thing is to make a style and to make the buttons work properly because the main um, the main issue, the main purpose of any landing page is to get the contact information from your visitors and uh, work with that information with email marketing tools uh, or just to make the phone calls to them. So you need to edit the click event and this is one of the most important parts of, of this video and actually of your landing page. So what's going to happen? There's a list of options. You can open a pop-up, you can open a Calendly pop-up, jump to a page section, link to a landing page or link to external URL. Um, I want the pop-up in most cases, uh, the pop-up is pretty okay. You can create a new one or you can edit the pop-up that you have. So send me my workout plan. In this case, now I will not change the text, I will change integrations. So how are you going to get information about new leads? Uh, you're going to get it to your inbox or you can switch on the external services of email marketing that will help you to work with your audience properly and uh, constantly. So constant contact, convert kit, get response, MailChimp, active campaign, eye contact, all of those are pretty impressive tools of email marketing. Some of them has uh, free options. Some of them you need to buy first, but it's really, really powerful tools. If you don't want to pay for the service, you can integrate everything with the Zapier. And for example, Google Sheets, you have such option here and you can integrate it uh, with the Zapier and all the leads will drop to your Google Sheets. And that's pretty cool, guys. Now, if you plan to, to get like hundreds of new leads daily, definitely you need to use the CRM system to handle with all that. Fields. You see there's only email and you can add a field. I suggest you to use the first name and email with this arrow so you can move them around. Do not use uh, more than two. Uh, do not use more than two um, fields to full field because you see this lead matter shows that our uh, page will not convert excellent. It will convert good. So if we're going to delete the phone number, now, the problem is that people are lazy and they don't want to fulfill all the all the stuff like so less fields more clients okay and next is actions what's going to be when somebody will actually press the button uh, in this case send me the workout plan and you can add the file itself right here and add a, a lead magnet to send to uh, email straightly or it can be external url that uh, can be useful if you're selling something uh, for upsell, cross sell and down sell, landing page um, with a thank you. You can build it with your own style. 
with your own uh, colors and so on or it can be default lead pages thank you page so it's up to you or it's going to be remain on page option we're going to save and close it and that's very important guys let's go to edit the section settings uh, of this one and we're going to change the background image you see that there's an image and we're going to change it you can use the images that you uploaded previously. You can use premium images um, from Shutterstock. You can buy them uh, straight from the platform and you can upload your own pictures and images. And that's what I'm going to do right now. OK, the picture is there and you see that uh, tax is pretty invisible right now. So we need to uh, apply image color overlay here. And we're going to add some color. It's going to be the dark gray, for example. And we change in the opacity. And you see that it's some kind of filter there. Yeah, the girl is still there and the text is pretty readable. Just need to change the color of the background. And that's cool. Yeah, you see, that's really and really cool feature with this uh, with this image color overlay I'm gonna change the I'm gonna change the style of the button I'm gonna change the color of the text to black and that's pretty awesome and that pretty works for this for this page you see that the background here is not the background of this section actually there's no color so we need to go to styles and we see that there's a page background we need to switch it off or we need to apply a color this one for example or a little bit darker yeah that works for me okay that's great and you see that everything is shaped nice the text is pretty readable and everything is great and the girl is there so it's it's pretty done if you want to if you have a long layout and you need to change the font styles you can change it straight from this spot for entire page and that's also a cool feature because it saves you a lot of time of editing and let's go to settings uh, seo definitely you need your web page to be visible to search engine machines if not you need to switch on the flag i don't want to search engines to index this page uh, in other cases, you need to type in the page title, description and keywords. If you want to share your um, landing page to some Facebook or some other social media platform, you need to take care about this picture because it's going to be displayed uh, like that. If you want to run your business properly and you want to get it, uh, analytical information about the visitors in your page, you need to switch on the Google Analytics tracking ID and you can change the language of this page straight here that's it guys that's pretty it we built a landing page under uh, under 20 minutes as i promised i wanted to make this video as short as possible and with the maximum value so my purpose is pretty done yeah uh, if you want to try to build your own landing page by yourself you need to find the link in the description panel of this video click that link and jump to the uh, to this platform fantastic and very very powerful that will let you um, go live with your landing page like in minutes if you have a content if you have pictures if you have videos definitely you can build it under 30 minutes and that's very and very cool thanks for watching this video till the end hope you enjoyed and hope you uh, will use this information that i gave you in this video see you in the next video don't forget to subscribe and press like to this video thanks bye bye